looks. Tell me about the game. Well, I felt very, really good about the first half. I thought our intensity on both ends of the floor and our concentration and focus um, led to our uh, halftime lead. And I thought that we, we really did a nice job each possession of uh, fundamentally trying to do what our, our game plan was. And then, unfortunately, the second half, I know we scored a, a few points and, and shot the ball pretty well. But I really thought defensively we took a big step backwards. So, um, But it is a win. And um, so we're happy about that. Uh, we're on the feeder right now we can't do any better than that but what we really need to have happen is this team to continue to press and go forward and, and grow and get better each time out and there were some things that I, I just felt like we did not do that tonight but um, we'll, we'll get through finals and get back to practice see if we can get iron some of those things out. So you got out-rebounded re out tonight, unfortunately. What are your plans to work on that? Well, we are going to go completely opposite of what we've been doing. This is the most we've ever emphasized in my life here at Northern Tuck University. Every drill, everything we do, there's an emphasis on rebounding. If you forget, if you miss a block out, you give up a rebound, our guys run steps. And we've done that for the last X number of months. So come uh, whenever we get to practice next Thursday night or Friday, we're no longer going to do it. We're just going to use a little reverse psychology, see if it happens, and um, maybe we'll be better rebounding team after this. And Chad Jackson had a pretty good game today. What are your thoughts on his performance? Well, I'm really happy with Chad. He's been he's been Mr. Consistent. Um, he's really settling into his role, understanding you know what he needs to do for our team. And the other thing about Chad is it, this is no fluke. The reason he's good and is very consistent. Chad's a tremendous worker. Whatever we're doing, whether it be in the weight room at practice, he just works his tail end off. And so when he's out here, that's why you know he has the ability to be so consistent offensively and defensively. Right, Van Hoos, you were second in scoring today. You had 18 points on the board. You did really well shooting in transition. What do you think about that? Uh, yeah, uh, the guards did a good job of pushing the ball, and I was uh, able to get down the court and get my feet set um, before the defense got set, and I was able to knock a couple down. Yeah, you guys actually got out rebounded today, though. What do you think about that? Um, yeah, that, that wasn't good. We didn't we didn't bring bring the effort we needed to bring in the in the second half, especially uh, on the boards and the defensive end. And uh, you know they just outworked us, and uh, we can't let that happen again. So what do you think next practice is going to be like? <laughs> Thank God it's finals week. I never thought I'd say that. No, um, it's good. It's going to be rough, but uh, it, we need it. Uh, we got a lot of young guys. Um, we need to get out there and work more. Um, especially if we're going to continue on getting better. And uh, we just need to work. Uh, we just got out work tonight. Yeah, and who else do you think did really well today? Um, you know, Chad played really well. Uh, Bear, he, he played solid. He's been playing really well. Jalen came off the bench and gave us some big minutes. And, um, you know, it was, a, it was a team effort. Once we found five that, that stuck out there and was playing hard enough, uh, you know. But everybody has games like that. You know, we're just kids at the end of the day, and we just got to get our focus back and, and improve. Dad, you led the team in scoring today, so what are your thoughts on the game? Um, I thought we played well today. Um, I think that the second half kind of, uh, you know, dragged a little bit. Um, but I think all throughout the game we played good. Um, just a couple stops in the second half and we've been fine. What do you guys think you need to work on for your next uh, game? Definitely just finishing games. Uh, like the coach said in the locker room after the game, they scored, uh, I think, 46 second half points. So. Uh, we can't be giving up that many points and a half to uh, to good teams, or we're going to come out losing. So, Kappas was telling me about your cool little spin move. Where did oh, you learn that? That was pretty I cool. I don't even know. We we practice it a lot in practice. Uh, me and my man stretch. We go through it a lot, so uh, it happened to work for me right there. So. Yeah.